Man, I'm getting some flack for this on Twitter. I don't know. Okay, maybe it's because I don't go into enough detail because typically my tweets are kind of a gateway to the videos I post and whatnot. But I think I made it pretty clear where I talked about how the dynamic between Fatima and Paul is eerily similar to that of Karen and Aaron. Now, you could, I feel like the difference is like, it's been established from the jump like hey paul i know you know you're feeling me and whatnot but i literally just got out of a you know serious relationship engagement with zach so i'm still healing for that and you know paul made it clear he doesn't mind being used my point was if you look at the similarities between the situations yeah Fatima is displaying some Karen-like tendencies. What I mean by that is Karen and Fatima, both recently out of long-term relationships with Zach. In the meantime, they're hooking up with these tall, light-skinned brothers. And they're unable to get, like, intimate with them because of the fact they're still hung up on Zach. So instead of sex... You know, they allow the guy to spend the night in bed with them, so they get held. There's a lot of tossing and turning involved. In Karen's case, that's probably more so because of the whole situation with Aaron's ex-wife, ex-wife's brother who broke into her apartment and tried to kill her. So, you know, obviously being back at the same apartment where she, you know, well, in the same room because it was in her bedroom where Zach got stabbed and she shot the brother. Um, basically, you know, she was tossing and turning and dealing with that, so... In the middle of the night, she would be calling out Zach's name. And guess what? Paul said the same thing about Fatima. And then from there, before being able to move into anything serious with the light-skinned brothers, Paul, Aaron, Fatima, and Karen both say, I'm still hung up on Zach. I'm still trying to, you know, let go of this hold he has on me. So until that time, I'm unable to give you what you want. And then both of the guys just say, I'll give you space, and they go about their business. Now, I don't know if Paul's going to pull an errand and just constantly pop up on Fatima every five seconds. But in any case, the similarities are there. That is simply all I stated. But, uh, oh, there you go, going after Fatima again, yada, yada, yada. No, I'm stating the freaking facts. And if you can't see that, I don't know what to say for you. Well, well really, I feel like we're in a situation where... Fatima is just, I don't want to say stringing Paul along, but Paul knows what it is. You know, he knows what it is, but he literally said like, there's a limit to this. And Fatima was like, excuse you. Basically, there's a limit to how long he'll just, you know, wait around for Fatima to get over Zach and, you know, basically give him some kitty cat, make basically give him some Roxy. But it's like, bruh. She just got out of this serious relationship, and I don't feel bad for him because, one, you're the one saying, use me, use me, use me up, do whatever you want, not to mention pursuing this woman when she was still engaged. On Fatima's side, it just feels kind of petty, like, oh, because Zach hurt me, I'm going to hurt him, and I'm not going to go back to Zach because he needs to learn his lesson and whatnot. And in the meantime, you're just laying up with some dude. And if you really think about it, Zach has never laid with another woman since he's been with Fatima. Now, you could argue that him and Connie off screen were in bed or something. But regardless of the fact, Zach was not with Connie for that long. He, they didn't have sex. So maybe kind of like with Paul and Fatima on the couch a couple episodes ago, perhaps they were about to do something, but Zach couldn't go through with it. So we got up and left. Whereas Fatima literally let Paul stay in bed with her all night long. Because if it was Zach in that situation with another woman, people would be dragging him up and down the internet streets and they'll never let it go. So for me to just make a simple comparison to Karen, I don't know what the hell the problem is. But that's just me. So let me know what you think. Do you think that uh, Fatima's pulling at Karen and just using Paul to kind of get over Zach in the meantime? Let's talk about it. Like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one.